What's up guys, welcome back to another multiplayer round. I just finished the MVP Open exclusive event, it's a paid one. So I have all my new discs in my bag. I got the Glide Shift and the Roll Rhythm from the uh, just the player's pack, like the GoPro pack that was in game. And I just got the Tempo. Glide Tempo is now in my bag. I got rid of the Glide Hope. So we'll see if we can get some use for either of those. We got Smu again on Champions Landing 1, 4, and 13. Ikigai Springs 3. Grizzly Gulch. See if we can get a fun one there. Frexley Snipes joining us as well. Let's see if we can get some excitement coming here. Started out on Champions Landing 1. That's yeah, a big win. I think it's forehand. I'm giving just a little bit of Anheuser to this. So I can ride the wind a bit more. If this stays out of those bushes, I'm happy. Yeah, pretty much exactly not out of those bushes. Let's see, I think, yeah, this is layup here. I don't have, I don't have a run of the basket to get into eagle range here. So I'll do the roll rive. Oh gosh, layup, stop, stop. That was a terrible layup. And of course, Smoo got it going around the backside still. Man, that layup sucked. Uh, let's go. Let's go the tempo just for kicks. Let's get it up here. And down stop. Oh my gosh, no. I forgot how slippery that green is. Bummer. Bummer. Okay. What a start. Starting with a bogey to Smoo's eagle. And a Frexley's, is he in? Birdie? Or did he go out somewhere too? To par. Down some shows. Gotta do some work to make him up. Here we are on Champion Landing 4. Yep, I think this calls for a forehand roll rive. Oh, probably could have been water skip, but it's gonna bounce, bounce. Oh, good. It kept... Oh my gosh, don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, I stayed in. Hopefully this means one stroke back, at least on Smoo. One on Smoo and two on Frexley. All right, so we're back in the middle there on an ugly start for this card. Here's going to be the like Glide Paradigm. Give it a little bit extra height just to make sure it comes back a bit more and not end up in those bushes on the right. And here we are with a very reasonable looking throw in with the fuse at about 40 power. Got it. Everybody's getting that one. Still got to try to get back two on Smoo at some point here. If you guys springs three, I'm going to go to bounce it. Maybe that's good. And that's good. I'm across and in front of that rock gives me a great look for Eagle. 406. Gotta flex the sapphire around it. If I can get it around that tree. Okay. Didn't get around that tree, but still a reasonable look here. 70, 80, 90. So I'll start with the true 70 because that wind's gonna lift it up a bit more for me. Alright, and getting the eagle. Got one back on Smoo. I'm coming for you, Smoo. Where is Frexley? Is he there for Eagle? Oh no. I think I must have got pinched off behind that rock. Probably had to do a rotate the world and get that putt up. All right, let's keep working on that comeback. One more to go. Not really much to do here. It's, oh, I gave that too much, Heiser. Oh, don't miss, don't miss the Mando. Holy cow. Ho oh, ho, okay. That was a little sketchier than I would have liked. Uh, this is still going to be Glide Sapphire off the tee, or off the approach. Get it up over here. Probably could have gone Rive to get a bit more distance out of this. But I think it's still reasonable. 80 feet with the headwind. We'll just do a true 80 on forehand. And get that birdie. Wow, that was, that was sketchy with that wind. I definitely almost missed the Mando by overcompensating. Ooh. I was thinking about the shift here. I'm not going to on this one. If that's kind of, oh, but is it going to hit water now? That headwind? Oh, get over, get over. Okay, barely over. 
I'm going to come into practice, but I'm going to try out the shift here. See if the shift gives me a good look. I off the tee on a backhand there. I feel like this green is shaped for a forehand coming in. But I'm going to try it. See if we can get something cool there. Ooh. Shifty? Let's get shifty. Oh, no. Come back. The shift doesn't come back. Of course not. Ah. Oh, that got so lucky up there. I thought that was going to be a disaster. Let's go forehand up here for the 40 power. That was so close to utter disaster. But Grizzly Gold doesn't leave a lot of opportunities for getting a stroke back, especially with these wins. I'll just throw the fuse straight out there. It's going to get on the green, but I don't have anything near an ace line in this wind. Putt with that tempo. Didn't get to throw the rhythm or let the tempo fly on this round yet. Well, I did let the tempo fly off the tee. Okay. Well, it's a chance. I think it's going to be Rive. Is this the aim point? I think this is right. Get the skip. Get the skip. Yes. All right. Smooth have a two. Oh my gosh, are we going to make the comeback? Let's get that sway to the right. Somehow the comeback to tie after that awful, terrible start. Wow, that was a lot of fun, guys. Thanks for coming along the ride with me, and thanks for watching. As always, stay boogie-free.